Hello, my name is ACB The Man, and you're listening to a supplemental episode of Radio Epic. This is specifically addressing the members of Clan Epic, and if you're listening to this and are not a member of Clan Epic, please go to the100.io slash groups slash 1412. You can join us, you can see what we're about, and then this maybe will pertain to you in the future. So, clans are changing up as you go into Destiny 2. You can no longer have a group of more than 100 members and only 100 members in the clan. If you have a Destiny 2 clan, you can only have up to 100 members. Affiliations are cut, and so we are figuring out ways to do that as we move into Destiny 2 as a huge clan. We were hoping they would up the membership to 500 or 1,000, but they're leaving it at 100, so we have to make some changes. And these are the specific changes that we are going to do, and this is from Coop81. Coop81 wrote this, the State of Epic Address, and now let's hear what he has to say. My fellow Epic Guardians, Destiny 2 fast approaches. As some of you may know, Bungie has introduced a new clan reward system where clans can unlock perks and achievements through any of the game modes whether you are playing solo or in a group of clan members. Unfortunately, Bungie is keeping with the 100 member cap and refuses to increase this number to support larger communities such as ourselves. They are also removing alliances from D2. They have left it up to the larger communities to decide among themselves how their clan will be represented in Destiny 2. The mods and founders of our great clan have been deliberating tossing out ideas on how we will transition into the new system forced upon us by Bungie. We have come to the decision that we will be renaming our clans going into D2. Here are the following changes. Epic will retain the Epic Clan tag as well as retain the name Everyday Player in Combat. This is our base model and our origins. Epic 2 will now be known as Epic A with the name Epic Alpha Squad. Epic 3 will now be known as Epic B with Epic Bravo Squad. Epic 4 will now be known as Epic D with name Epic Delta Squad. Any further extensions of our clan will follow similar military call signs starting with Echo Squad. Charlie Squad was vetoed as some didn't like the name Charlie. Along with this new name change and rebranding of our clan for D2, we will also be restructuring the membership levels of each clan. As the clan rewards are based on clan activity, we wanted all members to have equal opportunity to reap the rewards with this great clan. We will be balancing all four clans to have equal number of members associated with each, so not one clan will gain rewards quickly simply by having more members in that clan. Bungie has also stated that founders or admins can only be part of one clan. With this particular change, our MAR team will be splitting up and taking the role of founder for our other epic squads. The founder mods will be as follows. Coop81 will be the epic founder. Boo Boo will be epic alpha squad founder. Orphan Galaxy 545 will be Epic Bravo Squad Founder, and some dude in Virginia will be Epic Delta Squad Founder. Each squad will also have a secondary mod attached to it, and that will be announced later. August 23rd is the deadline to take D1 clans into D2. We have already selected that we will become D2 clans when the deadline hits. To help us balance our squads, we are asking for your help. As it stands, we are at 588 members on our 100 group. Not all those members bear the mark of our clan. So, for the members who do have the mark or prefer a particular call sign, please speak with the mods so we can start a list to divide the squads evenly. We would also ask if you have a fellow Epic friends you'd like to play with on a regular basis, please speak with each other so you can be grouped together in squads and let the mod know. We do not want these changes to break up our clan or the mojo that we have. To those who do who not, excuse me. To those who do not have one of our clan tags and wish to be part of our great clan in D2 to reap the rewards, please contact the mod and follow their orders on obtaining a mark. Also, if you have a preference in a particular squad, let a mod know so they can try to get you in that squad. Please be advised that a request with squad assignment may not be granted due to squad size and trying to keep all squads balanced. Once our squads have been balanced and ready for D2, we will then start sorting new members into each squad in sequential order. Note, any new member recruited by a current member or through a current member will be given the option to join the squad their recruiter is in. Balance of the squads in this instance will go to the next order of lowest member population. August 23rd is the Bungie deadline for a D2 clan conversion. We ask that all requests for squad assignment be received before this deadline so we can have ample time to restructure our clan. On a final note, myself, Coop81, and the mods, thank you for being great epic members and we hope that this transition is smooth and does not affect our camaraderie or build disdain among our own clan. We are still epic and we are still everyday players in combat and squad assignment does not determine your worth, skill, or popularity. We have only risen past the bar set by Bungie and will continue to grow until Bungie has to recognize the larger communities. If you have any questions or comments, feel free to contact one of our mods. 
Thank you, everyone. As always, keep your eyes up, Guardian, and we'll see you on the battlefield. So, it's as simple as that. We're trying to balance the clans. We're trying to rebrand ourselves so we're not just numbers and so that each clan has a cool name. So, per the instructions, if you would like to be in a specific squad, including the original Epic squad, please let a mod know if you have a group of friends. Please let a mod know that your group of friends would like to move. If you are asked to move to another squad, please do. It's going to be very simple. We're just trying to balance the clans. It's going to be very easy. We will get this done before the deadline, and we will have a great time in Destiny 2. The reason we are balancing the clans is because of the clan rewards. We do not want to have Epic have 100 members and Epic Delta Squad only have like 15 members and Epic Delta Squad is not getting the rewards that Epic is getting. We want to have everyone balance. That's pretty much it. So if you have any questions, feel free to talk to me. Feel free to talk to Coop. Um, we have, uh, who do we have? Excuse me. We have Boo Boo the Bull. We have Drifting Platypus. We have Fleeced Around Bar. We have Colonel Panic. We have some dude. We have Hot Dirk. So, I mean, any of these people you can talk to about joining a specific squad. That's about it for this short supplemental podcast. If you have any questions at all, please ask one of our mods. And uh, we're going to have a great time in Destiny 2.